welcome back to my youtube channel today we've got a very exciting haul for you guys we've got a mango and asos haul and now i did a poll over on my instagram saying what did you want to see from me what other haul should i do because i always do zara and everyone was like mango i had a ton of people saying mango so i did a mango order and i'm so glad you guys reintroduced me to mango because i actually loved a lot of the stuff there and i did kind of forget about mango there for a second so there's a lot of mango stuff and then there is some stuff on asos sauce that I also ordered we're going to talk about too so let's get right into the first outfit so first up we're going to talk about this grey knitted jumper it's got this lash neck on it it's kind of like a pole neck but it's got this little zip which I loved it's super soft material it's kind of a little bit crop but I will show you on and it's, it's soft and it's quite light it's not really heavy jumper so I got this in a size small it was actually 44.99 which I think is kind of in the mid range for a knit I don't know let me know what you think but I think it's probably mid range I wouldn't say it's super affordable but I wouldn't say it's super expensive either the quality is really nice on this and I will pop it on for you guys to see now I ordered this because the first thing I saw when I went on the manga website was a girl wearing this the model so she had this on in charcoal I think it might have been charcoal or black with a nice blazer over it and I was like oh that look is so good like I have to recreate it so this is what I've done obviously I've tacked it into my jeans they are ripped jeans and I thought that that was a good mix because this is quite smart so I thought to mix this with like the ripped jeans is like a good vibe and I just love it like I really really like this again it's super soft and I just think it works with the blazer over it I just do want to show it to you quickly without the blazer as well just for you guys to know what it looks like and to see it without the blazer but to be honest I do prefer with the blazer and now I'm not sure about this one I'm thinking I'm probably swaying towards keeping it because I do love the neck on it and it is super cozy but I don't know how much weight I will get out of it is my only one thing I've obviously tried it with 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 and without the blazer and I actually prefer it with so I would wear it with that but what else would I wear it with you know I tried to like zip it down see if I could wear a shirt underneath or anything but I don't think I could so I don't know if it's just the one way of this which is why I'm sort of a little bit unsure for the price and you know me I can't keep everything I do have to send back so this one I'm a little bit unsure but definitely let me know your favorites as always in the comment section below and let's move on to the next next up we're going to talk about these trousers and now what I did love about the mango website is there are a ton of trouser options and it's kind of the things that you could wear to work as well so that's what I did love about the website there was a lot of like work vibes that you could also pull off like somewhere else as well as the office and I'm still in the office so that works for me like if I can convince myself that something's for work then I don't mind paying for it as much which is so weird isn't it so anyway these are the trousers and they're quite high rise they are quite high up and they're this really nice grey they've got this um instead of a button which i love and they do fit really nice and they are soft like they fit nice i'm saying they fit nice because they cut nice but they don't actually fit me properly so what i should have done is ordered a smaller size i ordered the eight which normally i'm an eight to ten but they're actually a little bit big so they do not fit so what i've actually done just to show you guys what it would look like is i've just popped a toilet roll down the back like if you're a subscriber then you know this trick and i've just put a toilet roll in the back just to keep it tight just so it, it would probably if it fitted you this is what it would look like but obviously it doesn't fit <laughs> so yeah I do love these and I would have kept them if they fit however I'm 5'10 and they're just not long enough for me and for me I need to have something I can wear with heels and without so I can get those different ways so obviously I popped on with trainers here which I do love like a suit trouser and a trainer I love that look but I also would like to get the smarter look out of it as well with boots and I actually can't do that with these because they're just not long enough for me but do you know what if they were long enough and they fitted properly they would be lash but they just done so I have to send them back and there's literally no point me sizing down because they'll still be too short so like hopefully mango will do a tall range I don't know why they done but I would love a tall range and like a petite range in mango so hopefully we'll see that in the future because I do love these and I love how soft they are and they're such good quality but yeah just not working for me next up we are going to talk about this green hoodie which I love love the color on this it's like a sage color and you know sage is everywhere right now like the greens the sage and I thought you know what it was out of this and a knitted vest 
And I was like, oh, do I get the knitted vest or do I get the hoodie? So I went for the hoodie for a change because I've got a couple of knitted vests, but now I regret it. I think I should have got the knitted vest. So I'm actually going to link both them below just in case you want the knitted vest because it's really nice. So if you're browsing around later in the description, I'll, I'll link that as well so you can have a little look. So this is the hoodie. I do really like it. It is kind of crop. It's got these balloon sleeves. Again, super soft material. Like the quality is really nice. I got this in a size small and this was actually actually 44.99 again which again is that sort of mid to higher range I would say but obviously the quality is there so you know it does work I put it on here and I've cropped it up into my bra just to show you what it would look like because I felt like that's what I wanted to do when I put it on but I will show it to you without that as well but I just thought this would look nice so I popped on with these mom jeans and trainers just because I thought this would suit more of a cash vibe like it's not really that dressy obviously it's got the hood so it kind of is more casual and I do really really like it but I just don't know, again, with the ways, like how many ways am I going to get out of this? Love, love the colour, it's super soft, it's cosy, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to get enough way out of it to keep it. Obviously for the money, I just don't know. I've tried it on with a few different things. So basically, I've also tried it tucked in, nor in the bra, just because I thought, you know, you don't want your belly to be cold and we know I don't like my belly to be cold. So I've just tucked it in as well for you guys to see. And then also before we leave this one, I do just want to show it to you over a shirt because I thought maybe I can try that. But I don't know if it's working over the shirt either. I felt like I had so many ideas for this in my head. But now I've got it, I just don't know if it's like coming up to the standards that I thought it would. Do you know what I mean? Quality wise, a million percent it is amazing quality. But for me, I just don't know about how much ways I'm going to get out of it, but I do still like it. So yeah, let me know what you guys think on this one, because I'm kind of like this, but normally when I am unsure, that probably means I should send it back. Do you know what I mean? Okay, next up, do not laugh when you see me wearing this, okay? Because I had such great, like, aspirations, is that what it's called? For this outfit, and it didn't come off, okay? But, you know, forgive me, because <laughs> it does look not that good on. I'll show it to you. Let's just talk about it as, as general first because it is really nice stuff. So these are the trousers I got. Um, they're like obviously like suit trousers. Love the material. They're so nice. It's like a super soft like brushed material. Very soft. Very nice. A little bit different. Again they don't fit. So I've had to do the same thing as I did before with the previous trousers because they are too big and I got them in an eight so they are too big but I do love them. And when I put them on Claudia was like oh they're really nice. So I'll just pop them on quickly for you to see here with a roll neck before we move on to the full fit which is like a full on suit because this is them without that. I just wanted you to get an idea of what they look like without putting the suit jacket on. These were $44.99 again and again they're not long enough so I'm having the same issue where they're not long enough. So I can't wear them with heels, I can only wear them with trainers and they're too big so I can't keep them, like obviously not, but I could size down because I do like them with trainers and I probably could maybe, I was going to say I could live with not wearing these with heels but then for the price I'm like I want to be able to wear them with heels so I don't know but anyway these were the trousers and let me show you the blazer that actually goes with them. So this is the blazer that goes with them. It is like got a tie waist which I was super excited about. Again, it's the same material. I love the colour on this. These are the buttons. Let me just grab them. Really nice buttons. Just like a really nice vibe. I just thought it was going to be lush. It's got the waist tie. And I ordered this in a 10 because normally in blazers I do go to a size 10 because I don't want them to be too tight on me. But it's absolutely it's so big. Like it looks, it doesn't look right. It's too big. So this is it on together. <gasps> don't laugh don't laugh I know it's bad like I wanted to put it on because I wanted to wear it with nothing underneath like I wanted it to be like a low V with a tie waist high shoes like picture it with me <laughs> I had the vibe in my head but it just didn't come off like I accept defeat on this one the blaze is too big it all it's all misfitting I don't really know like it's not if it fitted well, it would be so nice. It looks so good on the model on the website. And then I was thinking I could get more ways out of it. So I could wear the blazer with different things. I could wear the trousers with different things. So in my head, I've got all these ways out of it. I could wear it as a suit. I could wear it as separate. I could wear it to work. Like, you know, like I had all these things and it's just failed. It's absolutely failed and I'm devastated. 
<laughs> so anyway, just to save it, like we all had to laugh about the previous clip, like showing my bra and stuff, but genuine, let's just have a look at it with a roll neck, which is how I would also wear it. And it does look nice, like I love it. I think if it did fit, like I should have got the blazer maybe in a, a six or an eight, I should have got the trousers in a six. And then if they were just a little bit longer, then I would have been keeping it. But it's not working as a whole it's all misfitting so it's gonna have to go back but it doesn't mean that i don't love it because i do and i do think that if it fitted you correctly you would look amazing but unfortunately for me it just doesn't fit but i'll tell you what how much it was just before we leave just in case you do want it and this hasn't like <laughs> convinced you all the blazer was the blazer was 71 pound <laughs> i can't even believe i just paid that for a blazer what <laughs> what was that even for the whole thing? Okay, guys. No, I'm sending it back. Don't laugh. The blazer was seventy one ninety nine. Is a bit much because it's not really like structured. So you know, like when you buy, when I bought blazer the other day, black blazer was structured. I knew I was wearing that over and over again. With this, it's not. So it's quite like loose. So I don't know what other ways I would get out of it. So it's going back. The blazer was seventy one ninety nine, and the trousers, which I do like, were forty four ninety nine. I like them, but again, it's misfitting. It's it's a little bit expensive. So let's move on <laughs> to ASOS because yeah, and I don't, I hate to leave on that one, like the, the worst one, but I do like mango and I'm so glad that we did a mango haul and then I did do the stuff because I did find some really good stuff and I would definitely order from there again. But now I know my sizes, you know, my next mango haul will be better, I think. So next up we have ASOS and this are the jeans that I ordered which I am loving. Like I love flared jeans and I always struggle because I don't get them long enough for me but these are long enough because they do them in tall. So I'm very excited about these. They are like a flare jean which I think is in like 60s are coming back in the 60s vibes. They're not huge flares but they've got a little flare and I ordered these in the tall section and the, I just love them. They're stretchy, they're really really comfy and really fitting and they're actually from like the hourglass range wherever that is but whatever it is I'm into it. So these are the jeans on, love them, absolutely love like I just love them. I don't know, obviously they do go with this outfit, but I know I'm gonna wear these a ton, a ton. I've got so many things I can wear them with. Jumpers, I can wear it with a nice shirt with like a little bit of a low cut vibe going on. Like I've got so much stuff I can wear these jeans with. And I love that they're long enough for me and that they flare because I've ordered so many flare jeans from Zara because I love flare jeans and they're just not long enough for me with high shoes. So I always end up having to send them back. But these are a winner because they're from the tall section. But I will link both red and petite and tall below if I can find them all just so you have a range obviously depending on how tall you are so I will link all them below but yeah absolutely love these from ASOS I got them in a size 10 which again is my usual size I couldn't have gone down to an 8 because then they would have been too tight on my bum so I've gone for the 10 and I've just tied a little lace around the back and normally I would try and hide it with my jumper but I actually don't think it looks that bad like if I seen somebody with that I wouldn't even think twice really I think it was part of the jean so I don't mind the lace in the back I'm happy to keep it I am going to ask my mother to take them in as always <laughs> hopefully Jules will take them in so they fit perfectly but until then I will be using this lace and lastly for the claws uh, we are going to talk about this coat this was 175 pounds which obviously is on the higher bracket uh, of the claws like I usually buy 175 I mean, it's, it's for a coat, so I would pay it, but I, I don't know if I love it enough to keep it. So it's actually from And Other Stories, but they obviously sell that on ASOS, and that's where I got it from. It's this lush colour, like it's such a nice colour. It's got these double buttons on it. It's so smart, and I did feel so nice when I put it on, but I'm just a little bit unsure. I think it's probably because I ordered a size 10, this is a size 10, EU36, and I think it's a little bit small, because obviously in the winter, I like to layer up so normally I would have a chunky jumper on underneath this I wouldn't just have like a thin top like the one I've got on now it would be like a chunky one so that's why I'm a little bit unsure about whether to keep it or not because it's a little bit small and then I could order the bigger size but do I want to I'm not sure let me know what you guys think on this one because I am unsure about it I love it and I love another stories but I don't know it's not like the softest material either like now I've got it on my lap and I'm feeling it it's a little bit itchy obviously it's not itchy inside because inside has got this material so you're fine when you've got it on but now i'm touching it you 
it's a little bit itchy but i don't know i don't know if that makes a difference but anyway i am unsure normally by now i would have like made my decision talking to you guys whether i want to keep it or not and i'm still on the edge so that probably means i'm gonna send it back but i love it i don't know what do you think let me know what you think on this one and let's move on to the accessories okay we're back in the middle to talk about accessories and the first thing i want to show you is a hat <laughs> Do you remember all the laughs we had in the summer on the hat? Honestly, I remember putting my Zara haul up with a hat and then I had so many messages on Instagram saying like, I'm so glad you're wearing the hat in Italy. And we had such a laugh because I was explaining that basically I love hats and I love seeing them on other people. But when it comes to me, I buy them and then I never actually wear them outside. They're just there. So I've done it again <laughs> because I did wear my Italy one, didn't I? I've ordered this one off Mango. And now I've seen people in this and I love him. I love seeing people in them. Don't know if I can put it off myself, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try and put it on now with you guys. This is actually the first time I've put it on, so bear with me. I don't know, what do you think? So this is the first time I've worn it. <laughs> Again, what? I don't know why I feel like this. When I see somebody else wearing these hats, I'm like, oh my gosh, you're so good. So fashionable, love it, chic, fab. When I put it on myself, I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> take it off on <laughs> i don't know let me know what you guys think on this i really want to keep it i want to wear it out i think from the side it looks a bit better does it i don't know this is from mango i do think it's cute i don't know if i'm gonna have like the the guts to keep it i don't know we shall see <laughs> stay tuned on my insta for that if you see a picture of me then you'll know i've kept it so i actually got this in a size medium which believe it or not there are sizes in hats and i've got quite a big head so i've ordered a medium in this and i'll tell you how much it was quickly so this is 16 pounds i think it's okay for 16 pounds what do you guys think like i like that this got like this detail in it i think it looks quite like a little bit more expensive i like with like the brushed i don't know i'm convincing myself that's a yes i got her in a medium again and it was 16 pound let me know what you guys think of the hats i actually love knowing what you think of the hats but yeah i think i'm probably gonna keep this one because i think it's cute and hopefully i'll have the guts to wear it outside so next up we're going to talk about this bag from mango again let me know what you think obviously it's a little bit of a dupe you probably know already from what bag it is a dupe for <laughs> probably not even gonna have to say but yeah what do you think I ordered it because I thought, you know what, I've only got like a darker tan. I've not got nothing this this colour. And I thought, ooh, maybe I need one of them. But I don't know if it's me, you know? Like, I don't know if it's me. Let me know what you think. Is it? Is it me? I don't know. I do like it. It is obviously that, like, material. Like, it's not, I want to say nylon, but I don't know if it is nylon. But, I don't know, I do really like it. And I am into it. I don't know if it's me. I think I'll have to have a little look in the mirror. And see like if i can uh, rock this or not because it is very small but i do think it's cute and i do think it's a good dupe and that was actually 17.99 which i think is really reasonable like accessories wise i think in all this stuff is really a lot cheaper than i thought it would be for the prices of the other stuff do you know what i mean so yeah do love this little bag i think i'm probably going to keep it and then let's talk shoes so we've got two pairs of shoes to get through. This one is from Mango and it's this really nice colour, like love. I've got nothing this colour and everyone was saying how great the shoes are from Mango. So I wanted to try and I do really like these on. Love them. They are very comfortable and they're not that high, which I think is good, especially for me with trousers. So I can still get, get away. Like I wore these with the um, jeans I spoke about and it was just the perfect length for me because the heel isn't that high. They are very comfortable. I got these in a size 8, which is my normal size and they were 62.99 which i think is a little bit i don't know is that average for, for shoes 62.99 it's not cheap is it but it's not super expensive either but they are they are nice and i do think if i get my way out of them they will be worth that so i am probably going to keep these what do you guys think of these let me know and let's do a last pair of shoes which are from asos and they're these like i've been wanting a pair of these for so long super super chunky boots love them love the lace up like you would have seen them on my instagram by now probably i just think they lash like i love them and i got these in a size eight and i will say they're too big so i should have got a seven but then once i had them i didn't want to send them back so i'm wearing like super fluffy chunky socks at the minute i should have got the size down so if you do want to grab these then you should probably size down they are a vibe i know if you're not into it completely understand but i'm quite into it i do love a chunky boat 
that is it for me today guys i hope you enjoyed this haul do not forget to subscribe before you leave today as i put fashion content out every sunday so i will see you guys next sunday